What is going on, everyone? It is Roaming Dead here, and we got ourselves a Q&A today. You guys asked me some questions, so here are my answers. All right, so one of the first questions someone asked me was my favorite childhood memory. And that is a tough one, but I would have to say going to the cottage as a kid. We had a place out just uh, about an hour north of Perry Sound. Terry, I'll put a little map up here so you guys see. Um, it was in a, on an island. It was amazing. Um, tons of rock everywhere. We used to, I used to hunt for um, frogs in like the little tide pools we had. Um, oh, my eyes watering. I love swimming, so that also, you know, plays into that. It was just a really good time up there. Sorry, my content lens is really bothering me today. Um, so, yeah, we had a really good time up there, and we ended up selling it um, to the rest of our family, and we got another cottage in Bracebridge. That's where we are now. I still have a lot of fun there, um, a lot of good memories, but like I said, I think that was probably my favorite childhood memories going up there. A favorite sport growing up? Um... I used to play baseball and soccer as a kid. I played baseball up until I got about to high school uh, and soccer when I was like six, seven. Um, I liked baseball, like playing baseball. I never was a big sports watcher. I never really watched any sports. But the X Games was the only thing I ever really watched as a kid because I thought it was really cool. Or skateboarding, snowboarding, stuff like that. Um, now, if you classify those as a sport, I guess any of those board sports would be what I would, uh, my favorite sport growing up as a kid. But yeah, anything, any along the lines of skateboarding, snowboarding, wakeboarding, um, I used to love as a teenager, but as a kid, um, I didn't really, wasn't really into actual watching sports. Like I said, I played baseball and soccer, but that was about it. Uh, my favorite game growing up uh, would probably be Pokemon. Um, I have a lot of good memories playing Pokemon um, on Game Boy. Um, of course, it wasn't color or anything like it is now. Totally different than what it was, um, but it was really cool. Also, um, Goldeneye, I have to say, is my other one. Pokemon and Goldeneye. James Bond, who doesn't love it? It was one of the best games for N64, and I will say one of the best games uh, ever. I loved, I loved it, loved it, loved it. It was so good playing with my buddies. Playing multiplayer was like... The coolest thing to do when you're in elementary school slash high school, get everyone over playing, you know, not don't look at my screen, don't look at my screen, don't look at my corner. You know, that was like the funnest thing to do now. Multiplayer is so much different. Um, I kind of liked back then when you, you know, you actually hang, hanged out, hanged out, hung out with people and saw people while you were playing instead of just um, playing online. Um, favorite game now? That is a very hard question. Uh, I think it kind of varies. So right now, I'm really liking Division 2. So I would say that's probably my favorite game right now. Um, but I have lots of favorites like Anthem, um, Ghost Recon Wildlands, Division 1, um, Monster Hunter World, uh, Final Fantasy um, 12, 13, 13, I think it was. Whatever the newest one was. Um, Apex Legends, um, even Call of Duty, like uh, Modern Warfare 1, 2, or 3, any of those were very, very good. So like I said, I think it depends on what's out and what I'm really playing. So right now, I think Division 2 is probably my favorite game. Favorite color. See, this is one question that kind of, I don't, I've never really understood. I don't have a favorite color. I don't have, you know... Oh my goodness! I need to have that in 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 red because I love red. I don't. I've never really felt like that. Um, I mean, I have a lot of black clothing, um, and I, I don't know. I mean, I guess if you want to say because I have the most black clothing, black is my favorite color. I guess, but I don't don't really have a favorite color. I mean, I like all colors. I shouldn't say I like all. Some colors I don't like. I mean, I'm not a big fan of like salmon or. Um, even orange, I'm not a huge fan of like my, my Goku shirt. And that's about it. But, um, you know what I mean? Like, I don't really have a favorite, favorite color. Like a lot of people are like, oh my goodness, I need that in purple because purple is my favorite. I don't, I've never really understood that. I've never really, 
never really been like that. Like I, I like color, I like blue, red, green, um, black, white, uh, even like, you know, aquamarine. That's some pretty cool, some stuff like that. I don't know, purple, pink, whatever. I mean, I'll wear it if it's, if it looks, I like the design on the shirt or whatever versus the actual color of the shirt or, or clothing or whatever we're, we're getting. Like, you know what I mean? Like that's, uh, that's just me though. I don't know. You guys might have a different opinion. Uh, any phobias? See, uh, that's, uh, I guess like the only phobia I really have is snakes. Snakes scare me to death. I remember growing up as a kid in, in Perry Sound area, there's lots of rattlesnakes. I shouldn't say lots of rattlesnakes. There are rattlesnakes. Um, so as a kid, I was always warned about rattlesnakes, you know, making sure, you know, be careful, make a lot of noise. So you scare them away, um, because you don't want to get bit by one. Um, I've never been bit by a snake. Thank goodness. Knock on wood. Um, but I've seen a lot of snakes on the road as a kid. We'd be walking down, you know, the road to the marina or to the store or something. And there'd be one that was on the ground. Um, we got run over by a car. Um, you know, and, and it was only a few feet away from, you know, the, the side of the road where we were walking. So it was always kind of, you know, one of those kind of scary things. And I, uh, as I've gotten older, just slithery snakes, just don't, no, I, uh, I don't like it. I like, I'll, I'll watch a, I'll watch a video and it won't bother me. But if I like, if I see them in real life, it's just like, Ooh, nope, I can't do it. <clears throat> nope, 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 nope. Let the kids touch them. I won't. All right, so another one was um, countries I want to visit or country I want to visit. Um, I'm a pretty big history kind of guy. I like um, World War One, World War Two history. So it'd be really cool to go to like England and Paris and Germany, um, and all those kind of countries that were really involved in World War Two, and and go see like the different memorials, the monuments. Um, you know, that kind of stuff. Like Vimy Ridge would be really cool. Um, going to, you know, um, seeing like, uh, you know, where they, where some of the front lines were or, you know, so many other places that have like, you know, rich history. Um, even Scotland, um, going into, um, I have Scottish heritage. So going and looking at, you know, some of the castles and the highlands and, and all that kind of stuff would be very, very cool. I think, um, always always wanted to go and japan japan i've always wanted to go just because of the crazy like technology and like mixed with like you know old um uh style uh just the mix the, they're so fluent together you know you, you have like you know people that you know have are like geishas and then next to a apple store kind of thing like it's pretty crazy i want to i would really love to go my first tattoo ever was this right here. I'll take a picture of it so you guys can see. Um, I got this when I was 18. I've all, I always wanted tattoos, but I wasn't sure what to get. And I saw this and I was like, oh yeah, that's really cool. And I thought it was being smart because I was like, oh, I can add names of my kids or, or something or whatever in the, in the banner afterwards. Um, yeah, it's not big enough at all. It faded. It was it's a, one of my worst tattoos I have. Um, it's, uh, it's always been there and, and I'll probably never get rid of it, but it's just one of those ones that I was like, man, I was 18 stupid and I, uh, didn't really know what I was doing and should have put a little more thought and energy into what I wanted. But you know what? You live and learn. It is a memory that will always be with me. So I can't say too much bad things about it. Um, and last, the last question I got was, um, my favorite holiday abroad. Now, I haven't gone to too many countries, um, but I will say my favorite trip I've ever had was probably when I went to Hawaii when I was three or four with my parents. Uh, my dad won a trip for work, so we stayed at, uh, I don't even know what hotel it was, some, some hotel, fancy hotel. And um, yeah, we just, we were in Hawaii for like a week. Um, you know, we, we went swimming, um, we, you know, we climbed off the mountains, we went horseback riding, we did a lot of cool things. Um, and I think that was probably my favorite trip, um, abroad, um, favorite trip in, in Canada. I still think is probably 
Um, we've gone to Vancouver a lot um, when we were kids, went to the aquarium. Uh, that kind of thing is very, very awesome too. I will say that's probably my second in Canada favorite trip. Um, so yeah, there's Hawaii was amazing. Uh, I want to go back again with my kids. Um, thank you guys so much for asking me these questions. I hope you like the answers. I mean, they're my answers, so I guess it's not really like going to affect your life all that much, but I hope you like them. Um, if you guys are new, make sure you like, subscribe, comment down below. If you want to see more of this great content, uh, make sure you hit that bell notification button to get notified whenever I upload a video because I upload all the time, guys. So keep an eye on my channel for great, great things to come. I got a lot of planned stuff for April. Um, I really hope that you enjoyed this. Like I said, thank you so much for watching and make sure you like, subscribe and comment down below. I will see you guys next time. Peace.